I think I'm influenced by anything I've ever heard, anything I've ever seen. Uh, if you're talking musically, then it's pretty easy. It's the Beatles, Buddy Holly, uh, Johnny Cash, and lately I've been really getting into Tom Petty. Mm, it'd be a hunk of hunk of burning love, or maybe a chocolate uh, Nick. I'm actually a serial killer. What I mean by that is I eat a lot of cereal. <laughs> I don't think I could choose the greatest singer. I would, I would give you top three in my opinion. I would say it would be Elvis Presley, uh, Freddie Mercury, and Roy Orbison in no particular order. That's a tough one. I think I probably would have to go to when uh, the Beatle invasion was just taking off in Great Britain. Just go in there and get in with all those bands, Rolling Stones, the Beatles, just get the thick of it. I think losing my sight and uh, hearing, because then I wouldn't be able to see all the beautiful things in this world, I definitely wouldn't be able to do music. So those would be my two greatest fears between the covers and the originals. I think for me, believe it or not, it's actually Boy, because uh, it's a song Stephanie wrote, and I felt like we were just discovering our sound and uh, where we were going musically, and that sort of was uh, laying the, the runway, so to speak, uh, for where we were going. So that one has a, a spot in my heart, I suppose you'd say. If I love singing and playing with Stephanie, doing original music, taking music that isn't ours and making it Austinized, it's a lot of fun.